Everybody wants to find the one when it comes to relationships, but the reality is often disappointing. Sometimes, you may find yourself asking what the signs he's not the right man for you are and what you can do about them. The answers to these questions are often complicated and may even force you to face some harsh truths. This video will help you gain a clearer insight into what it looks like when you are dating the wrong person. 8 Signs He's Not the Right Man for You Number 1. Your personalities don't match. You don't need to date someone who shares all your interests and habits. However, your characteristics should complement each other and help make you better people, not irritate and cause arguments. It's vital that you both can communicate and find common ground. If you find it difficult to enjoy the other person's company, it's time to reconsider the relationship. Number 2. Your family and friends don't like him. Sometimes outsiders' perspectives can be pretty helpful when deciding whether or not he's the right one for you. When your loved ones tell you they don't like your partner, take a minute to consider the reasons. Ask around amongst your closed circles for honest opinions. Maybe they misunderstand his little quirks and flaws, but perhaps they can also objectively see things you are blinded to because of love. Number 3. He's not who you thought he was. People can change quite a lot once you know them well. The longer you acquaint someone, the more of their true self you will see. Sometimes it's just a few bad habits, other times, you find out they're an entirely different person from when you first met. No matter the circumstances, you should walk away if the change in the person turns out to be negative. Number 4. He doesn't value and appreciates you. Respect is the key to any successful relationship, especially a romantic one. Someone who truly loves you will show their support and care throughout everything, from your everyday life to significant changes. He may offer constructive criticism, but he won't belittle you, your choices, or your dreams. He also won't have you make one-sided efforts and sacrifices to build the relationship. Number 5. You don't trust him. This is one of the most obvious signs he's not the right man for you. He may not be a very straightforward person, frequently hides things from you, or you could have caught him in a few white lies in the past. Whatever it is, he has proven to be unreliable, and now you have a hard time putting faith in him. Have a serious talk first. If you have tried this and he still doesn't change, it's time to go. Number 6. You don't want the same future. At some point, you will need to discuss how your relationship fits into your future plans. It could be something major like a wedding and kids. But also more short-term events like holidays, or meeting the family. There could be an issue if your ideas don't align. Be honest about what you want so you can either work things out or end the relationship amicably. Number 7. You have different moral beliefs. The more you spend time with someone, the more you learn about their point of view on important issues, such as politics, human rights, equality, etc. Even though this seems irrelevant at first, it matters a lot since it reflects their core values and characters. You too must believe in the same things, or you will frequently feel frustrated in the long run. It's best to end things early on when you find it difficult to see things the way he does. Number 8. You can picture a life without him. Think about your life if he isn't in it. Do you have trouble moving on, or would you feel normal about it? The latter means he doesn't bring much of a change to your daily life. What to do when you think he's not the right man for you? Number 1. Pay attention to the small things. Notice the little things, such as his caring gestures, his bad habits, or any external reason that might be causing you both to feel unstable. Talk it out with your partner, ask them to share their perspectives, and see whether the problems are something you can work out together. Number 2. Trigger his hero instincts. A study has shown that men are genetically wired to be protective over their loved ones. So they are more likely to seek out relationships that make them feel needed. Intrinsically, they want to protect you from both physical and emotional harm and make sure you are properly cared for. This is not a matter of personality but boils down to his genes, which explains why a man falls for a woman. The fact is that he will be into someone that lets him be the protector. In other words, they want to be your hero. Let him prove he could keep you safe, both physically and emotionally. It could be an excellent reminder of why you fell in love with him in the first place and a great indicator of whether he's the right one for you. Number 3. Take an overall look at your relationship. 
Some relationships are fun at the moment, but they aren't meant to last, while others could have the potential to become the love of your life. Take a moment and reflect on the nature of your relationship with him. Look at your reasons for dating, expectations, the depth of the connection, and whether you truly understand each other. Number 4. Trust your heart. Your heart knows best what you need and want. You find yourself looking for signs he's not the right man for you because instinctively, you already know he's not. Trust your emotions and trust yourself to make the right decision. The longer you stay, the more unhappy you will be. Don't hesitate to walk away if you truly believe it's something you should do. Heartbreaks can be quite messy and hurtful for all parties involved. But saying goodbye could be the better option for both of you in the long run. You will have learned some valuable lessons about love, and hopefully, when the next person comes around, they will be your perfect match. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to our channel and visit our website at shinetolove.com.